Hi guys, another video for myself. Yeah, it's been a while since my last video. Hasn't been a lot of time for painting over the past three, four weeks, unfortunately. Uh, but I have managed to get these fingers done. Now, these fingers are actually a commission. And I don't normally do commissions. But what it was, I sold, I think it was five of these fingers on eBay. And the buyer asked if I wouldn't mind painting another 13 figures to make a unit of 18 for his collection. And uh, so yeah, I did that for him and, and I just got these finished this morning. Just got the, the bases finished off this morning. So the glue's still a bit <laughs> wet in the static grass, but uh, yeah, so I thought I would do a video just to just like see what I have been doing. <laughs> uh, as I say, not a lot, but still keeping my hand in and getting a bit of painting done. Yeah, yeah, the customer has been really patient as well with his, yeah, I was hopefully, I was hoping to get them done about two weeks ago, but uh, yeah, it's been a very busy four weeks. Uh, just let you know what's happened. We've actually got a new member in the household. Uh, we brought home a puppy four weeks ago. So he's just 12 weeks old, so he's quite a handful. And uh, no doubt he'll make an appearance in one of the videos soon enough, but in the meantime, he's not allowed nowhere near the, the man cave in case he eats everything. But uh, <laughs> yeah, so no doubt you'll get to see him. He's a, he's a very fun, full of energy little chap. So yeah, my painted time is limited. But anyway, back to the figures, guys. As I said, there's a commission uh, for a guy, buyer on eBay. I will message him just after I do this video to let him know that they're all complete. And I should get them all packed up tomorrow, hopefully, and shipped out. I think he'll be quite pleased. So, uh, this video as well, I'll give him a chance to see them before he gets them. And uh, these are the Perry Miniatures Plastic Napoleonic British Dragoon set. Painted up as the 16th Light Dragoons. And uh, just, yeah. So, as I say, it's quite a big unit for me to paint. <laughs> My cover units are normally nine. Uh, and these are 8, so I just move that back. These fingers are 18, so yeah, as I said, with a limited paint time, it did seem to take quite a while to get them done. But now they're all done, I, I, I think they look really good. Quite pleased with them. Uh, same standard as the ones that in my own collection. A few different colour of horses there as well. Uh, so we've got the, the back rank with the shouldered swords. And the front rank and the arms with sort of charging pose. It's a nice variation. And the uh, I said the very plastics are absolutely lovely figures. The horses are brilliant. Really easy to paint. Uh, just to sort of, uh, there's not a lot of variation, but I have managed to, if you can maybe see, just some of the heads I've glued on at slightly different angles. It uh, just gives a slight variation to the unit. and uh, So yeah, as I said, the, the officer and the trumpeter, they did appear on another video before they went on eBay. And uh, so there's another little turn around. So that's it, guys. That's what I've been up to. My American Civil War unit, which I started a while ago. Uh, yeah, it's sort of came a, a halt at the moment. <laughs> But I will get back to them now, now that these guys are finished. Uh, I did manage to, if I just put them aside, I did manage to get, there was four spare fingers left over in the American Civil War unit that I didn't need. I'll just take these over. Uh, so I've painted them up and just based them singularly on the uh, spares. Yeah, so I think these guys will probably just end up on eBay. I, I don't really need them. Uh, See it and focus in a little bit. Yeah, there's a guy kneeling there. And the Perry's American Civil War Union Skirmishing box set. Uh, yeah, I've still got some other leftover figures as well. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I might keep them back and do another unit of plastic Union troops with the uh, right shoulder shift pose. So we'll see. Another guy there, just a variation of the headgear, and the slouch hat. Really nice figures, nice and easy to paint again, just 
not a lot to them in colour wise yeah, compared to the, the Napoleonics but uh, yeah still very enjoyable so yeah I might pop these guys on eBay as well surplus to requirements uh, yeah so that's it guys I'll just plan on it again and see that unit over there uh, as I say these will get packed up tomorrow and hopefully get them shipped off to the, the buyer in the next couple of days Anyway, uh, I've been watching all your, I have fallen behind quite a bit actually watching you guys' videos. I think I'm about two weeks behind at the moment. But I'm catching up slowly. Uh, I'm not leaving comments, but I am clicking the like button. So, apologies. I am I am liking all the videos there. But I will, once I catch up, I can maybe start commenting again. Uh, but yeah, keep up all the good work, guys. Really enjoying it. And uh, yeah, that's about it. So, again, thanks for watching this video. I hope to have another one <laughs> in in the near future, not quite so long as this one's took to get done. And uh, yeah, take care guys, enjoy the hobby. Cheers for watching. Bye bye.